Hello there and welcome to Living Your Best Life 101 where you'll find exercises, workouts and recipes for optimal health and well-being. If it's your first time here and you like what you see then why not consider subscribing to the channel and click on the bell to get notified every time I post a new video. Or alternatively, you can click on the link in the description box below to my website where you can find access to all of my exercise content and much more as well. In this 15 minute stretch and relax workout, we're going to be warming up and mobilizing the joints and then gently stretching the muscle. This is a great routine for the day after a harder workout, maybe at the gym or after one of my full body workouts in one of the WellFit classes. It's gonna help you to ease any stiffness or soreness that you might have and leave you feeling positive and energized. Or else you might want to do it to help you to relax and wind down after a long day. So let's get started with the warm up and mobility exercises. Just a gentle squat and front raise. Push the bottom back, keep the chest up high. Add now a little leg raise to the side squat and lift. This little routine we're going to be working on here is going to be really good for helping you to increase feelings of wellness and well-being. Okay, march it on the spot. Take the arms back. Big circles. You've got some really nice stretches coming up for you. Bring them forward now with the arms. Really nice stretches that are going to help to relieve any soreness. Now raise the knees and just twist to the side with the arms. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of any stiffness or soreness you've got from the previous workout. I'll leave you feeling good. Relax there, bend it down to the side, just mobilize the spine now. Stretch a little bit in the sides. Yeah, it's not nice to feel stiff and sore. So it's really good to get moving again, straight away. Okay, arms up, shoulder level, just rotating the spine. Nice and easy. Just warming up, remember. Okay, just open the legs wide. We're just gonna lunge gently from one side and then to the other. Yeah, and these stretching exercises as well are going to be really good for reducing any lower back pain. Maybe you sit all day long and this is really going to help. Okay, just a little lunge forward, arms out to the side, alternate legs. And just going to gently now Soften the knees, twist in behind, keep the chest up high, back to the center, the other way as well. Twist, deep breaths, and the other way. Feeling that improvement every time we exercise. Getting stronger, and relax. Okay, we're gonna balance on our left leg. Balance, spread the weight on the left foot. Lift the right knee up towards the chest. Focus point to help you balance. Just pull the knee up as high as you can. So stretch in here. Don't worry if you lose your balance. That's gonna change from day to day. And relax, change over. Same thing, balance right foot, focus, find balance, lift the left knee. Certainly don't be comparing your balance to anybody else's. Working within your limits and just working to get better each time. So lose your balance, just find it again. Stretch that knee into the chest and relax. Okay, we're gonna take the left foot back behind us. We're going to press the heel down, make sure the foot faces forward, bend that front right knee, lean forward so we've got a straight line with the back leg and the body, push through the heel to stretch the calf. 
Remember, these stretches we can practice every day between these workouts. It's gonna help you release any stiffness, increase your flexibility. Okay, bring the feet together. That same left leg, lift up, take hold of the foot if we can, knees together, arms out to the side, or right arm out to the side. Focus on a point in front of you for balance. You should feel that stretch in the front of the thigh, the quadriceps. Now, if you want to increase that stretch, just gently push the hips forward. Gently forward. Okay, relax, release the foot. That same left leg goes forward in front of us. Curl the toes towards you, bend the right leg. Your weight is on the bent right leg. Push your bottom up and away from that left heel and reach forward for the left toes. See if you can reach there, hold that position. Deep breaths. And relax. We repeat everything on the other side now. So the right foot goes behind. Make sure that foot's facing forward, not out to the side. Push back through the heel. Bend the front knee. Just lean forward. Push back through the heel. Each time we practice, stronger, more flexible. And relax, feet together, right knee up. Take the right foot, left arm out to balance. Find your balance, knees together. Hips now gently push forward. Don't worry if you lose your balance. Hold and breathe and relax. That right foot now goes forward, plant it in the floor, bend the left leg, push the bottom up and away, weight on the supporting left leg, reach forward with the right hand, stretch in the back of the right leg, the hamstrings. See if you can push yourself a little bit further now without feeling any pain and relax, feet together. We're gonna bend at the hips, grab our elbows, knees slightly bent, ragdoll pose. Just let the head drop down, look at the feet and just gently twist side to side. Feel that stretching in the lower back. Any tension releasing from the upper back and the shoulders. Breathing deeply all the time. Now slowly, hands on the knees, slightly bent, raise up. Right hand on the hip, left hand is gonna go up. Deep breath in. Gently over, release the breath. Stretching up the side, the left side. And also, now reach slightly forward. So stretch up the back as well as the side. Hold that position. Deep breath in and out. And return to the start position. Repeat on the other side. Left hand, left hip, right hand up, breathe in. Breathe out, reach over to the side. Reach slightly forward as well. Breathe into that stretch and return to the start position, relax. Hands together, push the hands down towards the floor. Left ear goes to left shoulder. So we're stretching that right side.
tension releasing in the back of the shoulders and across the neck. Relax, repeat on the other side. Push the hands down, right ear to the right shoulder. Feeling good, feeling strong, feeling flexible and positive about the day ahead. Got those endorphins working around our system now, making us feel good and relaxed. And relax. Now, chin onto the chest. Push the hands forward. Thinking about the day ahead with positivity, with an open mind, an open heart. And relax there. Hands now go behind the back. We relax the shoulders, push them back, opening up the chest. Same way that we're gonna keep our minds open to all the possibilities possibilities of what might be today. Being aware of those little hints and nudges that the universe can give us. Paying attention to them. Relax the shoulders. Take the left hand up. Drop it down the back. Bend the knees slightly. Engage the core. Gently push down to stretch the triceps. The same way we're going to stretch ourselves metaphorically today to be the best that we can be, the best version of ourselves. <sighs> by being kind, by being positive, and being loving. And relax, change sides, take the right arm up, drop it down the back, chin up, Core engaged, knees slightly bent. Again, gently push down. Deep cleansing breaths. Feeling good in the mind and in the body and in the soul, I hope. Relax the arm. Bring the arms by the sides. Give everything a little shake. Deep breath in and out. Take the arms up, breathe in and out. Arms by the side. If you've enjoyed this video then don't forget to like it and share it on your social media and leave me a comment in the comments section below and if you haven't already don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click on the bell to get notified every time I post a new video or alternatively you can click on the link in the description box below to my website where you can find access to all of my exercise content and much more as well so well done good work today I hope you're feeling better now if you would like to continue working out then you could check out this video here if you want to do even more stretching or this one here if you want to do something a bit more intense with a yoga fusion hit strength workout but either way i hope you have a wonderful day ahead and i hope to see you in the next one real soon namaste and bye for now <laughs>